Okay, the Apple event is over and the big question, should you get the iPhone 14 or the 14 Pro Max or even the 14 Pro? I'll tell you this, if you're using a 12 below, fine, you can upgrade. If you're using a 13 and above, stay with it, you're not missing much. But apart from that, other, ins other exciting things that were released alongside the iPhones were one the Apple Watch. Now, the Apple Watch Series 8 comes with three different editions, the Series 8, the SE, and also the Apple Watch Ultra. Now, the Ultra for those that are performing some really extreme sports like scuba diving, swimming, surfing, and all of those extreme sports that really needs that level of detailing. For me, just getting the 8 is fine enough, or even the SE. That is also very much okay. We had an improvement to the AirPods Pro. It's still called the AirPod Pro, but it's now with a H2 chip and some gestures were added for sliding up and down. The active noise cancellation is better. The transparency mode is also better. These are some of the new improvements to it. If you're going to get the 14 Pro or if you're importing it, please, if you don't plan on using an eSIM, do not get it from the US. 14 Pros or 14s that will be shipped to the US are going to come without the SIM tray, meaning it can only use an eSIM. Now, though MTN has eSIM capability in Nigeria, I don't know how many of you have that or how many of you are willing to, you know, try that. If that's something you're up to, fine, go ahead. But if you're planning to import it and you want to use a SIM card in it, you can get this from other distributors or even other countries to import this. We all know when this thing hits Nigeria, the price is going to almost double. So if you're planning on doing that, be careful and know where you're importing from exactly so basically i'll give you a general over recap of everything that happened we had new phones the iphone 14 is way 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 better it has a feature called the island mode where your notifications do not interrupt everything you're doing the apple watch came with three different variants the watch the se and the ultra the airpods now come with a better h2 chip enabled for better active noise cancellation and some other improved gestures and that's basically it in a nutshell. I did a live video for it and thanks to my amazing friends at Yari at Bobai. And um, we had a special guest that I'm going to tag on this channel. Thank you guys so much. And let me know which of the phones will you be willing to get. Are you going to get the 14 or the 14 Pro? Or are you even going to get the AirPods? Or should I say the Apple Watch? Let me know in the comment section. Have an amazing day. Like and follow for more.